Katie Ulander, of United States, starts the women's skeleton run to at the 2022 Winter Olympics, Friday, February 11, 2022, in the Yancheng district of Beijing. AP photo slash Dmitry Lovsky in the early morning hours, on Saturday, February 12th. Breckenridge resident Katie Ulander returned for the finale of the women's skeleton competition at the 2022 Winter Olympic Games in Beijing, China. On Thursday, February 10, Ulander alongside fellow American, Kelly Curtis, competed in the first two heats of the women's competition. After the first two heats, Ulander sat in eighth place while Curtis finished in 21st. After the third heat of the competition Saturday morning, the field of 25 women was reduced to the top 20 for the fourth and final heat. Curtis had her slowest run of the competition, finishing the course in 103.24, which put her on the bubble to make it into the final heat. However, the last few competitors moved ahead of Curtis, bumping her into 21st place and out of the final heat in her first Olympic Games. Curtis finished with a combined time of 3.09. 23. Ulander, on the other hand, added another solid run to combine with the two she had on Thursday. Ulander's third run was her best so far this competition. She was clocked at 1.02. 15 to combine for a total time of 3.07. 0.2. Ulander was not flawless on her run as she did have one high transition, but she made up for it with a couple solid transitions toward the bottom of the course. Ulander's performance was enough for her to move into 7th place going into the final heat with the podium about a half second ahead of her. Going into the final heat, Ulander most likely needed to dip under 62 seconds in order to move into a medal position. Ulander had another consistent performance on her final run as she executed on clean lines and turns to finish the course in 102. 21, which was her second best time this competition. Ulander finished with a combined time of 4.09. 23, which put her at the top of the competition while the remaining six riders performed their last runs. Ulander ended up being displaced by the final five riders and finished in sixth place. Ulander's sixth place finish marks a full circle moment for the 37 year old skeleton athlete in perhaps her final Olympics. In these games, she matched where she placed in her first Olympics in Torino, Italy, when she was 22. Hannah Nies topped the competition, capturing gold for Germany. Australian Jacqueline Narakot took silver, and Kimberly Boss from the Netherlands took bronze. Nice finished with a combined time of 4.07. 62 which was 62 seconds in front of Narakot in second and 1. 61 seconds ahead of Ulander.